Hey there, welcome back to Heinzel. That's me, and I'm gonna be playing part two of Poppy Playtime chapter one. So if you wanna see chapter two, or chapter three even now, uh, like and subscribe, and I'll do, be doing that very soon. But for now, we're gonna play Poppy Playtime chapter one if I can speak, I'm sorry. Uh, so if you haven't watched the part one already, go watch that. We had a lot of fun, we got to see, uh, I, I learned his name now, Huggy Wuggy. We got to learn Huggy Wuggy moves he's actually alive he didn't kill us earlier he's very nice but now he's alive and he's actually trying to i think he's trying to kill i don't know he hasn't really done much we barely seen the guy but uh yeah we did some cool things so check out part one and uh let's get started into part two okay uh can I, see, you can move so many things in this game Ooh, look at that. we uh we played a few tapes i, I missed one because i was uh not the smartest and uh oh look at that look at that Oh, there's a tape. We need to find a tape, guys. So, if you see a tape, let me know. And, uh, the, all the toys are bleeding. I think that's kind of weird, but, uh, but yeah, they're bleeding. Okay, uh, Huggy says remember to take breaks. And I just heard, what was, what was that sound? Can I jump over this? Ooh, oh, you can't, okay. Uh, Huggy isn't here. Isn't there something glowing? Okay, I'm assuming we put these, oh, I was right, into here. See, I... Again, I, I get some. Ooh, we need to find uh, three more. Can I just, is there fall damage? There is not. What I hit? Okay. Uh, oh, found another one. Oh. Uh, I always forget how the mechanics work. Come on, open that. Okay. Uh. Oh wait, wait. If that exits that room, that probably means the tape is in here. So uh, let me know if you see a tape. Because I am not the tape finder. Okay. Uh oh, there's a lot of things in here. Oh, what the heck just happened? Oh, there's blocks. There's a lot of these toys. Uh, the bee thingy. I probably need this. I thought that was... I think that's the hand. I think that's the other hand I can get. Hey, look at that. I'm trying to hide it back here in the corner. I can't hide from me. Hey, okay. I'm actually fine. Wait, is that, is that all of them already? Rabbit. Rabbit, thank you. Stupid kid. I'm, I'm, you guys, you guys can just stop watching now. I find, I'm finding things too fast for this game. Security camera. They're just making up names now. They got, what was the guy in the first, the first part of the game you saw? Like Leech or something. Rich Avery. Let's go listen to Rich, Rich Avery, whatever he has to say. Uh, where's the, oh yeah, it's over here. And then we'll go put those batteries in. We have to go this way anyways. This one, that one just fall over there. Where are they keeping the monkey boxes? They've all just been still images. I don't know what the image of the first thing was. Remember when Bates had left the sweep of this place? No. Exactly. Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Orphanage? Right. I guess it's a nice program and all. This is a toy factory. Uh, it's just hard to be happy about it. The manufacturing's not our neck about it. Because we can't buy Hey, calm down, calm down. Oh, Rich Avery, dude. You're right. It's for the orphans. It's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. Anything less would be more of it. Scott, I've never heard a, a dude like have this loud of a voice in real life. Okay, uh, that was the video clip. I I don't know. Somehow boxes and getting angry about corporate stuff. Sorry, I, I'm I really don't know the lore of this game, so I'm just kind of going along. But whatever the robot, this guy, I'm assuming he's a robot or an animatronic. He's trying to kill us. Oh, go yeah, go grab that, go grab that. Are you gonna bring it over to me? Right here. Right here. Why is there a yellow hand? Aren't the hands red and blue? Yeah, yeah, oh, oh, okay, just gonna drop it, I guess. Yeah, might as well. Why not? Hey, two hands! Sorry, that was stupid. Okay, uh, now we got two hands, baby. Let's make our way. This stupid cat thing. Uh, yeah, see, see? How do you get my stuff? I get my stuff. Oh. I'm not going in there. Just kidding. Uh, okay, now we can crouch. I didn't know you could crouch in the first part. 
It's a slide. Yeah. I don't like this. Oh, oh, this is a power grabber. I grabbed it in the... I'm about to turn on that guy in that clip if it doesn't work. Okay, so, uh... I'm not getting something. Uh... I can't get up this. Maybe... Okay, this is new. There... Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. I can't. Oh, okay. Okay, we'll grab that. Oh, I've never been anywhere here. There we go. That, why wouldn't that work? Oh wait, these things from earlier. Oh, okay, uh This needs to wrap around so we have to get this up. Now I might now it's there we go. Oh crap, okay, I can't move now. I I can't move. We're going up. You know, toys will be falling off this this is not a good design. If you ever made this factory, you did not do a good job. And this conveyor belt suit, how's an how's an engineer gonna get in here to fix crap? Oh crap, what is that? Oh those body parts. Oh those body parts anyway. What is the story behind this place? Oh wait, wait, oh wait, the toy parts. Never mind. Right? Those, those aren't yeah, okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm not the I'm not the smartest. Ooh. Make a friend. Let's make a friend. Make a friend. 1960 uh da, da, da. Elliot Lugwig was a visionary. He said stage. Where is feet at the music? Complex sorting and backpacking labor. Okay, so the machine does builds the toys, right? What is back there? Why are the machines themed? Can I get back there? No, okay. Sure, why, why, might as well. I'll be able to get back there. I don't know, there's a lot of conveyor belts out there, though. Okay, make a friend. Uh, one of those tubing things. Okay, I don't know what to do, but we're gonna go upstairs. Because that needs power. Okay, there's gonna be a tape somewhere, so if you see a tape. Parkour? Okay, yep, that doesn't make that doesn't make sense. Good design. Good design there. I thought things work in real life. You just walk through it, it just you just phase right through it, yeah. Probably, probably the giant orange handle would help. Okay. Okay, I'm figuring things out. We need to hit these. And we're stuck, okay. Uh, why are we stuck? We gotta hit here, right? Oh, wait, 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 I see a tape. That's what I'm talking about. Wait, did we, yeah, we got, we got, we got the tape. We got the tape, let's go listen to that. And then we'll figure out this this complicated puzzle. So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Yeah, what they want to make you want. Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. Probably the money, the paycheck. You know, that's what, that's what I was supposed to work with. Anywhere in the world. With a hand? It was such a great feeling. Being able to work at a toy factory somewhere that can You ever played play with a toy when you're younger? Like, it's such a good feeling. That's a pretty great feeling, too. Everything's like a good so, feeling. I really, really wish I could go back to being a kid. I mean, and it's weird, because I love being a kid. Adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older, and it's older, and then you die. Getting dark with this, okay? Human bodies can stay young forever. There's this is a lore job right here. Like some I'm calling it. Can stay alive even while being way older than a person. I mean, some, the oldest the, people. I bet you the story, and I'm, I'm not. I don't know the lore, but I bet you it's something to do with. So me. I guess everyone is always young relative to something. They're turning right? people back into kids. It's not oh, actually right. toy factory. I just solved the whole lore. 
right in front of you. Right in front of you. I just break. I just made history. She come out wanting to be young again. That's it, guys. That's it. I solved it. Okay. Hey, I'm th there. We go. Okay. So this needs to go there. Now, now we go around. Now we go around. Uh, okay. What? What? Okay. So that's not the right thing to do. Can I pull this out? Oh wait, wait. Oh, I, I have to do this first. Okay. So let's try this now. This is so good at games. What is that? What is that doing? Uh, so like this would kill you in any other game, but yeah, but of course it doesn't. Of course it doesn't. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, needs power. It's so, like, what are these hands actually used for? What was that? Oh. Hey, this box is moving the back too. Yeah, are they supposed to do that? What's with adoption? What, are they are they like harvesting kids or something? They they mentioned adoption twice. Can I crouch? Oh, wait, how about crouch? Yeah, I go in there. Okay, or don't. We just went in there. So I'm not a pay attention. I get so distracted. Okay, wait, wait. Something went in there. Uh, I just saw. Those things spawn, but you know, it's fine. It's that freaking cat. Okay, so now they uh now the the parts are they're uh I don't know. We're going in there to this guy right here. And uh oh oh it built it it built the toy we're making a toy I'm getting it now oh it's isn't it it's make a friend. What is this? That's some that's some ruin right there. Those colors, exact colors. Okay, and then it comes down here and uh, oh you grab it. See? This this whole factory, if they didn't have a single conveyor belt, there's no glass there. What are you If there wasn't conveyor No! Oh okay. If there wasn't conveyor belts in this factory, this whole place would shut down. Okay, so, our, so this is getting kind of long, so I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.